I want your body. I want your body on meme. I want your body on meme. I want your body. I want your meme on. Hi, everyone, and welcome to another episode of the Meme Review. We're back. It's been a little while, and I apologize. But you know what? The memes have been pretty garbage lately. You know, there's that one with uh, uh, SpongeBob, and he's mocking people with the fucking chicken thing. Who? But there's a little news from the meme verse. Uh, Emperor Emperor Lemon made a funny video talking. God, why is my nose itch? Emperor Lemon made a funny video about why behind the meme is is not that good of a a YouTube page, um, making fun of the fact that he sort of lost any credibility that he had. Now, what behind the meme doesn't understand is that why your boy Fantano comes out winning is because you can't ruin your credibility if you don't start with any. P- cue, cue the man touching his head with the smile. Thank you. <laughs> Today's meme, respect women. This is not really all that popular of a meme, uh, but I do like to highlight this meme because basically it highlights the fact that in 2017, anything can be a meme. You can make- I know some of y'all are probably sitting out there thinking, can can I be a meme? Can I one day be a meme? And you know, honestly, if you set your sights high. But respect for women, it's a pretty funny meme on the internet right now. If you go on the internet, you look up respect women meme, you'll find a lot of funny pictures where you have an object which is being acted upon uh, by another person, a thing, or something that can uh, sort of perform some kind of action. The object being acted upon in these images is typically women. Now, the action that is being placed upon these women, uh, whether it be like a rocket going into the side of a mountain, <laughs> or whether it be some cereal being poured into a bowl, or there are other examples as well. Here are some of the other examples. The action, the th- the action that is happening to the object being acted upon, that is is always respect. Don't catch your position. I will kill you. And the person or thing performing the action in the images is is always depicted as as me. That is me giving respect unto women. This image macro alteration, this image with a few pieces of text thrown on top of it, this is depicting me myself as delivering respect unto the fair sex. R-E-S-P-C-T, well, find out what I mean, a little respect. One, two, three. Can you believe how many people think my BuzzFeed video is real? God damn. In a way, I think it's kind of a response. Maybe I'm just kind of throwing shit against the wall here. And and what else is new? That's just typically what I do. I think it might in a way be a reaction to the uh, perception of sexism just kind of permeating every facet of internet culture. Doing doing a little, uh, doing a little... Doing, I don't want to say spoof or goof because you guys are already telling me every fucking time I come out with a video that my channel is just some H3H3 or Sam Hyde ripoff or some bullshit or like oh your your channel's just like you're just like Eric Andre fuck <laughs> People who uh, are in the meme community and are sort of in the know with this meme, I think a good way to sort of greet each other, to give each other a little bit of a nod, give each other a little bit of acknowledgement. Oh, you're 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 with the shit. Um, you know, I think maybe approach somebody, and this is just my suggestion. Uh, and, you know, just be like, hey man, thanks for respecting women, bro. Thanks for respecting women. That's all I gotta say. I know you're a woman respecter. It's just so preposterous that such a thing became some obscure piece of internet humor. You know, you might as well just be like, hey guys, new meme I just came up with. <laughs> traffic light. Hey bro, I know you wait at traffic lights. So here's here's an image of me making this meme. Here's me, and this is me stopped. This is me stopping, okay? It, it is now just dawning on me that a lot of the, the this meme depiction, the respect is, it's kind of violent. I think this this meme might be sexist. I, I don't think this meme is very uh v- very very fair or friendly to uh, the 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 opposite sex. To be frank. Oh, may- maybe it's ironic.
might be ironic. Nah, it's, it's, I'm pretty sure it's sexist. All that being said, let's, let's give this meme a score. Let's score the meme, shall we? Uh, I give this meme 500, 500 points for just being plain old silly. Uh, I give this meme uh, t 200 more points because you can tell I'm just coming up with the numbers on the fly. <laughs> I give this meme a hundred more points for uh, the the versatility because I find the the application of me uh, action me is taking and object that is being acted upon. It's a pretty loose framework. There are a lot of things that you could put into that framework to sort of make that meme work. I feel like uh, if people really sort of focus on this meme, uh, the meme's stock could could go up because you have a lot of people sort of working uh, on this meme. Uh, uh. Because Lord knows we don't need another goddamn SpongeBob meme. I'm just saying, guys, try something a little different. Why, why has it got to be another SpongeBob meme? What does another SpongeBob meme really add to the culture? This being said by me to you, meme expert simultaneously, meme layman doesn't know anything about memes, not involved in meme culture, hates meme culture, wishes he was culture, but hey, let's do a serious par portion for a second. If you're still watching this video at this point, I know because you guys follow memes and you're sort of outsiders and everything, I know you probably have some emotional issues and, and you're real messed up. Let me know if there's a serious topic you want me to address in the next video down there in the comments. If you want me to talk about uh, sadness, if you want me to talk about, hey, it's really hard for me to uh, uh, get dates. Uh, hey, it's really hard for me to uh, get the motivation to uh, get up in the morning and respect women. Any issues you feel like you're having, just hit me up in the comments. Let Tofu Tony uh, do a serious video next where he addresses these issues and sort of tries to help you out, give a little life advice. Okay, that sound cool to you? All right. I'm going to give this meme a, uh, a semi-dank meme. meme. I feel like it's semi-dank. And uh, it's, it's a good respectful meme, a uh, good female, uh, pro-female meme. Here's uh, some respect. Hey, buddy, did you hear the news? It's meme reviews. That's knocking at your door. Don't watch them anyway, fuck you. <laughs> Spider-Man, I'm going to be a little bit of a spider-man. I'm going to be a little bit of a spider-man. I'm going to be a little bit of a spider-man. I'm going to be a little bit of a spider-man. I'm going to be a little bit of a spider-man.